are announcing the arrests this morning of Martin Shkreli and Evan Grable and the unsealing of a seven count indictment charging Shkreli with securities fraud conspiracy, securities fraud, and wire fraud conspiracy, and Grable with wire fraud conspiracy. Director Cherezny will also announce the filing of a civil complaint against Shkreli and Grable by the SEC as part of their parallel proceeding. Now, the defendant, Shkreli, is charged in all seven counts of our indictment for orchestrating three interrelated schemes, two involving two different hedge funds that he ran, that he founded and he managed, and the third involving Retrofin Incorporated, a publicly traded company that Shkreli founded and at one point controlled as its chief executive officer. <clears throat> the defendant, Evan Grable, a New York City-based lawyer and outside counsel to Retrofin, is charged with one count of wire fraud conspiracy for his role in the Retrofin scheme. The company's interest used his law license and his training as the cover so Shrekeli uh, could perpetrate his fraudulent goals. Now by these arrests and the unsealing of this indictment, we hope that the message is clear to hedge fund managers, corporate executives, and attorneys who may be committing similar crimes or thinking about doing so. And if it's not clear, here's the message. The message is that we'll be tireless, this office, the FBI, our partners in the SEC, and our, and our efforts to uncover your schemes. We want to speculate on his uh, reasoning for trying to increase the price on those drugs. Uh, as you'll see from our indictment, uh, six of the seven charges charge him with conduct involving uh, the two hedge funds uh, that he was, uh, that he, uh, uh, that he started uh, and that uh, he blew the money in. Uh, this investigation centers on his conduct as manager of these funds. Uh, we're not aware of where he got the funds that he raised to, for the Wu-Tang Clan out. Sir, if convicted, what kind of time does he face for each charge? Uh, the top count, I mean, the, the, the maximum sentence that he can face is 20 years. Of course, there are guideline ranges uh, that we won't discuss at this point, sir.